Starting this Wednesday, businesses here in California can no longer sell flavored tobacco. This is a voter approved effort to deter kids from vaping. Action News Now reporter Margot Rowe shows us what this means for smoke and vape shops in Chico. By the end of the week, California's smoke and vape shops will all have their shelves cleared off of flavored tobacco products. And some businesses are already feeling the impact. The vote on banning flavored tobacco products goes into effect on Wednesday, and smoke and vape shop employees I spoke with tell me they are uneasy about what could follow. I mean, the lack of funds coming to the shop, this is like a family shop, so I can't really, I know that my job isn't like, solid anymore just because ba it's based on how much we make here is how much I'm allowed to work. Some shops have even closed for good like Net Vapes and Chico. The company announced on its website that all their California locations would be closing. While it may stop miners getting these flavored products, some people think that this ban won't stop people from buying the products. People will find a way around it. It's just kind of making things more difficult and taking money out of you know small businesses like us. One person I spoke with said they're all for the ban, saying it will deter minors from becoming addicted to nicotine. But several smoke shop customers and employees found the ban to be unreasonable for adults. Prohibition, I don't think it works. Prohibition doesn't work. It's been proved historically it doesn't work with alcohol. I don't think it's going to work, you know, here. I know it's not like a federal thing, but, and like I said, you know, if we're taking away, you know, this at this point, what time, you know, when are we going to take away flavored alcohol? When are we going to take away wine coolers? You know, it's just because... Also, because like if it's just about the flavors, I mean, I get 40 year olds who come in and they love the gummy bear flavor. Who doesn't like gummy bears? The manager of the dungeon told me they are discounting the last of their flavored products on these last few days in efforts to sell majority of the products. Whatever is left over will be sent back to manufacturers. In Chico, I'm Margot Rowe for Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. California is the latest state to have some type of restriction on flavored tobacco, along with Massachusetts, New York, New Jersey, and Rhode Island.